Sorry for that. That was me. This one. Pretty big whoops inside a New Mexico police station. The officer you just heard apologize is wearing a different badge these days. Yeah, that's right. Albuquerque Public Schools just hired him to work for the district's police department, mm -hmm. and parents have a few questions. Yeah, and the biggest one, of course, you know, how could a school police officer currently being investigated at his previous job for firing a gun inside be allowed to protect kids. Spencer Schott has been looking into this situation and gives us our first look really at what happened the day that gun went off, Spencer. Yeah, Tesla, Trevor, while you don't actually see the gun going off in the security video, you do see and hear the aftermath of multiple other officers coming out trying to figure out what happened. It was a quiet February evening at the Los Lunas Police Department. No one was in the officer lounge and the hallways were empty until... A single gunshot echoed down the hallway. Other officers quickly came out to investigate, but they soon learned the gunshot came from one of their own. Sorry, what's that? That was me. You okay? Yeah, I thought my shit was out and I was practicing my shit. Sergeant Buster Whitley comes out of his office and admits he pulled the trigger, thinking his gun was empty. Luckily, no one was hurt, but an LLPD spokesperson confirmed there were two other people in the office with him when the shots were fired. Two weeks later, Sergeant Whitley resigns from the Los Lunas Police Department. The department spokesperson confirmed there is still an ongoing internal affairs investigation, and while they can't give any details about that investigation, they did share this diagram, showing Sergeant Whitley was standing just inside the office door, facing an empty wall when he fired his gun. And just two minutes before the shot was fired, Sergeant Whitley can be seen practicing, pacing up and down the halls of LLPD with his loaded gun pointed in front of him. But the story doesn't end in Los Lunas. Two weeks after he resigned, Whitley was hired by the Albuquerque Public Schools as a police officer. An APS spokesperson confirmed all APS officers are armed. Now we asked APS what school Officer Whitley will be working at so we can alert parents, and we were told that we would have to file an Inspection of Public Records Act request in order to get that information. And about a week later, we still are waiting for that request to be fulfilled. Back to you. All right, we'll continue to wait as long as it takes. Spencer, thank you so much.